Hello everyone, welcome to the second episode of Battle Chasers Night War. Okay, so... That took a lot of time. Oh, what? Fire barrier swing. Okay. Well, I thought this was a, a boss. The ruins just off the road here. They look military. This must be one of the Iron Outpost's old way stations, which means the outpost is nearby. Should we search it? Doesn't seem like the highest priority. Hmm. Like, I won't loot. <laughs> That's my problem, is because I'm a very looty person. Flint. Uh, sure. Though in the ruins, the former scale of this mighty fortress is evident. Nature has begun reclaiming the old stone, and the smell of moss weaves with the salty breeze swirling around the entrance. Now crawling with bandits, time to figure out what power is drawing looters and criminals to the ancient side. Like. I don't know. I, I suck at this, so let's just go with the normal. Iron Outpost Dungeon. A 
bowl engraving is set at the base of the statue. Here the watcher keeps vigil over the iron outpost with warning for those who enter. Tread lightly. Oh god. Iron outpost friend, I think. I did not do that. What the heck? The message appears to be iron and old. Oh, to be from an old textbook. Shortly after the outpost was complete, the true scale of the mana reserves on the island became evident. Vensler knew his small outpost would need to grow into a full garrison if his valuable operation was to be adequately protected. Though the name never changed, the iron outpost became a massive point of military operations in the area. The alls became vast and winding taking shape around the nearby foothills, often burrowing through them. 
The number of soldiers stationed there grew exponentially, and the influence of their population soon became evident elsewhere on the island, as new towns and camps cropped up throughout. The indigenous population was small and still weak from their struggle with, with virus, offering little resistance to the change. Where to go? Fine, I'll go this way first then. Okay, cool. The passage appears to be from an old textbook. When the Dark One fell, the Veil knew peace for a short while. Few felt any reason to revisit after Virus was defeated, for nothing of value was known to exist anywhere on the island. That all changed abruptly when the Mana Wells were discovered. King Vanslor, still young in his years, realized the importance of the discovery and quickly sent an attachment of his best troops to the island. Their mission was to begin the construction of a coastal outpost that would serve as Vansler's main stake of claim to the new frontier. The work was slow at first, as local wildlife, some fed by mana, arrest workers and cause delays. Once the first and most basic walls were complete, the outpost soon uh, became operational. Oh, what? Okay. I fucked up. That's definitely not what I wanted. 
That's Steph. I'm dead. He's dead. Oh wow, what a dumbass. What a dumbass. I don't think I can fish yet. This mysterious cube hums with energy as you approach. An inscription has been etched on its side. Some boxes give, this one takes. Catch it if you can, and empowerment awaits. Not sure what would happen next. I don't trust it. Fishing is a fun, relaxing activity and can also bring its own special rewards. Make sure you have a good rod and lure equipped from the fishing section of your compendium. Walk up to the edge of the water and cast your line. Once you have fish on your hook, pull your rod in the opposite direction of the fish you swim in order to reel it in. Be careful not to pull in the wrong direction or your line may break. A scrapped early test prototype to create C based infiltration max. Okay. Yeah! Woo! I got it! Oh my goodness. So. Five. Oh, shadow coin. Shadow coin and shadow coin. Okay. 
Okay, man. Hopefully this was worth it. yourself honey Fuck you. Fuck you. <coughs> Hi, asshole. Leveled up. Okay. Uh, 
The passage appears to be from an old textbook. Decades after its construction, the final order was given to abandon the iron outpost completely. Remaining mana on the island was so scarce that no major operation could be viably sustained. The conflicts Vansler was dealing with elsewhere became um, full-blown wars, relegating the once critical island to obscurity. As military forces withdrew, the original inhabitants were left to fend for themselves, often contesting with criminal forces hoping, hoping to uncover and extract and remaining sources of mana, no matter the cost. As this happened, major communication lines with the people there were essentially cut off, creating the air of mystery that currently defines the land. Before on, other conflicts around the world forced Vanslord to restructure his allocation of military resources. The Iron Outpost was one of the first major military installations to see dramatic drops in troop numbers. This also coincided with a sudden decrease in the available mana in the area. Many of the mines and wells became inefficient or simply ran dry, making the decision to redirect troops elsewhere an easy one. As this happened, smaller factions began vying for the scraps of mana still available on the island. This appears to be in a delivered letter. Boss, a few ships came in by sea. Try it anyways, we took care of them pretty quick. The boys pulled a few survivors out of the water. We'll bring them your way when we can. Seems they'll be useful for whatever it is you're doing. I don't wanna know. We're still digging through the outpost trying to find the, uh, thing. Be a lot easier if you just told us what it is. Meaning, no offense. Uh, in fact, forget I asked. Um, I guess I could just cross this sentence out. And this one. Nah. We'll take payment the usual way. Last batch was too fermented. By the way. Uh, by the by. Gold was just fine though. Givens. Okay.
Shortly after the outpost was complete, the true scale of mana reserves on the island became evident. Vanceler knew... Wait, what? Oh, God. Okay. Damn it. I did not see this. Okay, we're level 4 too, never mind. hurts.
this guy should be hurt from the trap. the XP I can get, you know? Oh! Wouldn't it be amazing if this was healing? Okay. the dungeon map a handwritten journal entry scrawled on parchment the general is a man of glory truth be told I like the others feel drawn into the wake of his power as he strides by Ravenheart slapped me this morning saying it was just the armor and to keep my distance from him says it's severe has lost his way Ravenheart is a fool why can brothers never get along his jealousy is transparent. The general went to battle a man and return is more than, it, than that. Blah. The general went to battle a man and return is more than that. It's blasphemy to suggest so, but he's like, uh... He's, the entry becomes incoherent. Okay. Like, this is one long ass thing. Ooh, what is that? Is that the boss? A handwritten journal entry is scrawled on parchment. Journal Tsevier returned from the main front last night. Because he came in darkness, few got a good look at him. Other than to say he seemed well. The wars elsewhere have taken their toll on the outpost, with ranks thinning and or thinning, and our defensive practices becoming lax. I'm not sure Ravenheart even bothered to take his patrol last night, but then he always did seem the lazy sort. That should change with Severe stalking the halls once more. Car lost. I need to be careful because I have 10 minutes to get this finished. Okay. You caught a surveyor. I don't know who that is. The game isn't explaining either. Oh lordy Lou, oh lordy Lou. Hold there. You will go no further. You can't end here if you tell us where our friends are. Dead, certainly. If not, they will be, after we kill you. You shouldn't have come here, outsiders. Oh. Okay. Um... I wanna do this. That's fine. Let's do this. That's fine.
What the fuck was that? You got this. got something. Hold on. Um. the episode right here thank you so much for watching i really really appreciate it and i'll see you soon